What up everybody, it's your boy Theo Pitts here. Make sure you subscribe on YouTube so you never miss any Run Your Race content. But if you ask all those players and people in that faculty, they, 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 don't, they don't know, but they know the sessions I had with Braun in the bubble in the film. Braun, sure. you fucking up. For sure. You're messing up, Braun. And what, what, what came to, Braun doesn't know you know you. He knows. He knows. No, he don't know me at all. He don't yeah. know you. No, just right. you know as a plane. So how did how did that relationship build? As far as like, how did you gain that respect for him? It like, which is it's really not yeah. like I know it's not that hard because when you talk basketball and you talk about the game, yeah, you're like, oh, JD know what the hell he talking yeah. about. Yeah, you know yeah, what I'm saying. Yeah, so yeah. like, was it just that, or was it like a long time all, over the period of time? He's just like, okay. Yep. We need this voice. I, he he was doing Space Jam and we, the 6 a.m. workouts that yep. we went to go there. I'm doing that. I'm playing. And at this time is, they don't even know my personality. I'm quiet. Yeah, yeah. I'm just like, hey, on the court, hey, strictly business, stay in shape, let's go. And then we go to Vegas. Braun has a, the pre, a little before a camp workout. I'm, I'm just going to dinner. We're not even hanging out. Yeah. It wasn't until we're on the road and you start the gambling table. Yeah. And you get in the gambling table, you start talking to trash, you start yeah, getting yeah, to yeah. go. And we went to Phoenix. Uh -huh. And I threw a little uh, team bonding yeah. experience. Yeah. And once I threw the team bonding experience, they're like, oh, oh, okay. Yeah. I see what JD is. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. And then now personality starts coming out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then now I'm not playing and I'm fine. And then now in film session, AD, that's not it. Yeah. Because mm. I know I have a first year, not a first year coach, but Frank Vogel, it's his first team, but it's all a coaching staff that he didn't hire. The organization hired it. So they're all like, all right. Can they call Braun now? I was about to say, yeah. We do the same thing yeah, now. Yeah. Can we call Luke out? Yeah, we call Luke out. Yeah. Well, how many times? What are we going to do it? How? And so at that time is, hey, let me take it off your plate. Yeah. Let me call him out. Yeah. Yeah. So that now they can, you know what, Jared, you're right. Because he respects you. Yeah. yeah. But not I, saying he didn't respect yeah. the coaches, but like, but if it's your homeboy to say sure. something to you, like, but also okay. too, is we gave Braun, like, listen, Braun, you can mess up one doing this. You can be lazy this time. You can't be lazy twice. Yeah. 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 You can get back door once. You can't get back door twice. Yeah, right. AD, gotcha. listen, bro, when you get the ball, go to work. Yeah. Don't wait for the double. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Like, so it was different stuff. Cause you know what? It's gonna be all the other guys messing up more than them. Mm, so yeah. when it's out there, I, I'm not gonna I see a clip go by, they mess up and we don't say nothing. Nah, nah, nah. I'd be like, rewind it. You're the king of that. You know what I mean? Rewind it. Like, oh, <laughs> nah, 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 we're, we're not, not doing, doing that. that. Nah, nah. Yep, yeah, we're not yeah. doing that. We're not doing that. Listen, listen. Yes. <laughs> we're doing it. Yeah. yeah. And they respected it. Cause if you can gamble with someone, if I can eat dinner with you, drink wine with you, hang out with you, go to a movie with you. I can tell you what you're doing wrong. Yeah. Because now I'm the guy, well, I'm not trying to steal your minutes. I'm here only to win. Yeah. That's oh, all I'm here. So if you're not gonna listen to me, and now looking back on it, they knew I, I was I was coaching then. I'm coaching now, but I'm watching film with those guys. Caruso, Dennis Schroeder, who came back. I was his by my locker, I'm watching film with him. I'm telling you, listen, you gotta throw the lob to AD. You, you're a bounce pass. He's a lob guy. Yeah. Yeah. You gotta change. He's not changing. Yeah. You know, and sometimes you gotta have these conversations, and and, and that's why I think that. I'm a player's coach is because they can respect not only you played, I'm going to tell you. Now yeah, we can right. argue about it. Yeah. And that was the whole thing with Russ. I was supposed to go back to help bridge that gap. Yeah. That was how it was supposed to be. It didn't end up working out like that. But now I'm telling Braun and Rich and the Lakers, this is what I can, this is what I can provide that you guys don't even know. Yeah. yeah. And so uh, players respected it. I don't believe the management respected it as much because I would have been back that following year, which mm -hmm. it happened. It, was, it all happens for a reason. And if I if I stay there then I don't get this coaching job. Yeah. Yeah. Then we, we, we probably wouldn't have won the championship. And now I'm looking, what am I going to do? Yeah. This is too good of an opportunity to pass up. Pass so up, it ended up working sure. out perfect, man. For sure. You knew you was going to win it? You knew y'all was going to win it? That year I knew he was going to win it. We was loaded. We were the number nice. one seed. It was up for the Clippers. Clippers are the only other team I was worried about. They beat us more times than we beat them. Yeah. Kawhi and Paul George were playing at a high level. Yeah, um, uh, I wanted to be in the Western Conference Finals, LA, LA, mm -hmm. at home, obviously COVID had, had yeah, a bubble. Yeah. And then once they lost to Denver, Denver was good, but they weren't beating us weren't. at that time. No, AD no. and Braun were playing at such a high level. We had so much depth. Rondo became in playoff Rondo. Um, but to be honest with you, I had a good time, but I feel a little cheated. We in a parade. Yeah. We went to Vegas and we went to Vegas when no one was there. Our parties, we're just, our, just us. Imagine going to a pool party, you got 20 people. Yeah. <laughs> Ain't no one in there. I, like, I see you know what I'm saying? Right? Yeah, 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 yeah. So I thought I cheated a little bit of that. I still have my ring. I still, you're still cemented. You still have that. But to be honest with you, um, still close with those guys. It, 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 the experience you have, of now you're a champion. Now as a coach, I can go into coaches meetings like, listen, bro, I've been on a championship team. Yeah. Yeah. I've seen it. Sometimes it's not always black and white. 
Sometimes you got to let it be a player, be a player. JaVale coming in with two chains, walking in. Yeah. Rondo wearing an Apple Watch on the phone yeah. during practice. <laughs> Braun eating fruit while coach talking. Yeah. All this, hey, tuck your shirt in, all the proper. Listen, that's not listen, how it bro. goes. Yeah. This ain't, ain't Bob Knight, bro. It's listen right. here, man. They going to perform? All right, bet. Yes. Perform. And so there's a difference between a vet team and a young team, and I understand it. And so I, that's why I'm just soaking up all these different coaches. Of, hey, I, I like what he does. Oh, I like what F Frank, Doc River. I'm just taking a little bit. So once my time comes, because it, it ain't, ain't going to be too long, then now I've had all this experience, and now I know where to tap in from.